In today's rapidly evolving, data-driven landscape, higher education institutions must harness the power of analytics to stay ahead. The 2024 EDUCAUSE Analytics Landscape Study dives deep into how institutions are using data to drive strategic planning, optimize operations, and enhance student outcomes. Perceptions of leadership sentiments toward analytics are largely optimistic. A majority of respondents indicated that their institutional leaders have proactive, optimistic sentiments toward analytics. Data are deemed to be accurate and useful at many institutions. A majority of respondents said that data are somewhat or greatly accurate and useful for analytics at their institution. Analytics play a key role in shaping different operational areas within institutions. The most popular use? Admissions and enrollments, with 76% of institutions saying they rely on analytics to guide these decisions. When it comes to learning, analytics are most often used to track student performance. In fact, 71% of institutions say that they rely on analytics to keep tabs on how students are doing. Most institutions are using analytics to break down and explain what's going on. Descriptive analytics topped the list as the go-to method for informing all functional areas compared to other analytics types. These findings suggest that institutions are currently using data most commonly to summarize and describe what is happening or has happened, and that there is room for expanding analytics capabilities to answer the question of why, to make predictions, and identify actions or next steps. Despite having fewer resources and support, smaller institutions are just as engaged in using analytics as larger ones. This suggests that smaller institutions are making the most of what they have, demonstrating efficiency and a strong commitment to leveraging analytics, even with limited resources. Not everyone is jumping on the AI bandwagon yet. About a third of respondents said their institution is using newly integrated AI features in their existing analytics tools. Understaffing and skill gaps in analytics are a big issue. Most respondents said they're short on staff across all analytics areas, with only 32% or fewer reporting they have enough team members to get the job done. Analytics is a strategic priority, but governance is lacking. A majority of respondents felt that at their institution, analytics is considered to be a strategic priority and necessary for effective decision making. These findings suggest that while analytics are viewed to be a strategic priority, institutions have not been able to fully mature their capabilities to successfully and efficiently implement processes and infrastructure to support strategic efforts. Institutions are prioritizing data security, privacy, and access and control in their policies and guidelines. The analytics policies and guidelines that institutions have implemented somewhat mirror their analytics strategies. The top three areas for policy and guidelines were data security, data privacy, and data access and control. AI tools are slowly gaining traction in higher ed analytics. In line with findings related to strategy and use of newly integrated AI tools, we found that relatively small numbers of institutions are using AI tools to support analytics. Less than a quarter of respondents said that their institution is using AI tools to support the different use of analytics. Only a few respondents said their institution is in the process of acquiring new AI tools to support analytics. What can institutions do to level up their analytics game? In the short term, they highlighted the need for more training and professional development. Investments in technology and staff, better data integration, and stronger collaboration across stakeholders. Longer term, institutions are focusing on strategic planning, aligning with institutional goals, improving data governance, and addressing the ethical side of data collection and usage. The potential impact of data and analytics at institutions is far-reaching. Read the full 2024 EDUCAUSE Analytics Landscape Study to explore more.